Hi guys, it's William here, and today I'm just going to be making a quick video. Um, I've just um, bought Fallout 3 off Steam on the sale for £5, and um, it's the first time I'm reinstalling it in quite a while. And um, I came across a problem where it was just freezing. Now, it took me a bit, but I realised, you know, what, what was causing the problem, and the uh, problem was, it was some pretty simple, but it was pretty annoying, you know, I, had, I have a good graphics card and everything, and it kept crashing, and I was wondering what was causing the problem. So, um, I'm going to basically go through now, if you have having the freezing problem like this, then I'm going to show you how to, you know, um, fix the problem. So it's pretty simple, all you need to do is um, go to your um documents then go to your my games and go to fallout and open up fallout here and I got I've made it pretty simple now I've pretty put some instructions here I put this in the um in the video description so you need to do is control find in here See what the problem is. Um, you gotta remember this game was made quite a few years ago now, and there used to be computers used to be optimized for two core systems, so it couldn't handle the four cores. So what we're basically doing now is um, basically making it so you only use two cores on your system. Push me, I just lost it where it is on the screen. There it is. So just down space one, paste that in, save the file, and you can close all that down now. And what we'll do now, we'll just open up Fallout. Uh, I'll uh, <laughs> image that out. So you know it's uh, it'll be we work and find now once it loads up. First time. So I just load up the screen and it's working fine. And no freezing, because now it's only using two cores on your system. Now some say the performance will decrease, but um I say you it won't decrease much. So yeah guys, um, thanks for watching, um, please remember to comment, rate and subscribe, and um, if you liked the video, I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching, bye.